theme for this playoff series, including the possibility of Paul Pierce, who had a strain MCL diagnosed. He's been dealing with that for a couple of games. Horford got his first start back in game five and was very good. Horford misses there. Josh Smith with the tip in. Here's Pierce. Knees all wrapped up like a mummy. And, <laughs> yes. But playing well in that keep first warm. half. Keep those knees warm. He had 12 points and four of six shooting in the first half. Kirk Heinrich to beat the buzzer at the end of the first quarter. Extra pass, little replay show. Very close though, man. And Atlanta took a 23 to 20 lead. Marvin Williams got off to a good early start. Huge tonight, four or five for Moneyball. He had 11 points in that first half. Michael Petras with the putback. Boston goes on a run in the second quarter. It's Rondo to Pierce and one. Pulls them within one. Rondo down low to Kevin Garnett for the layup. Boston up by three. And then Rondo take it himself. A 16-0 Celtic run puts Boston up by 10. Third quarter. Josh Smith, no. Joe Johnson with the rebound. Atlanta back within six. Johnson from outside knocks down the three. Joe trying to shoot him back into the game. 17 on 17 shots for the night for Johnson. Rondo, long jumper as the third quarter expires. Take that. I'll answer your buzzer beater and match it. Tough shot. Boston by four, fourth quarter. Garnett in the paint right over Josh Smith. Had a flashback tonight, 28 and 14. Garnett showed up tonight, huge for him. Horford with a little running layup there. Six of nine from the field, he had 15 and nine. Such a huge boost for this team. The dunk there, and it's a one-point game. Here's Smith, puts it on the floor in the finish. That gives Atlanta the lead at 76-75. Late, it's Garnett in the post. Turnaround jumper. Puts him up 80 to 79. Johnson to the baseline. Pierce played him hard. Block shot. Atlanta fans will say a lot of contact below. Yeah, a lot of contact, but it looked like Pierce knees were okay then. <laughs> <laughs> Great inbound play drawn up by Larry Drew with Marquise Daniels trying to go guard Horford. They sent it over the top. He's fouled by Daniels. Misses the first. Makes the second. So Boston up by one. Pierce is fouled. He's going to go to the line. First was good. Likewise, the second drops. Ooh, got a lot of rim on that one. Rattles home, but a three-point advantage and only 1.3 to work with. Jeff Teague really couldn't get anything going there. Trying to figure out what was the inbound play. In situations like that, you're supposed to have something set up for a desperation three. It's like everybody was standing around like, what's going on? 